Okay, so this is the first episode of a new series we're going to start. It's going to be called Trampoline Talk. And basically, me and my friends are going to discuss uh, what's going on at trampoline. So today, we're going to discuss uh, what we did at practice today. And then we're going to discuss our, um, you know, our short-term goals for the coming up uh, meet season. My name is Bruce. This is Lawrence. My sister Shelby. Lawrence's brother Dan. Um, so it's Friday, the day after Thanksgiving. It's Dan. It's me. Um, um, so yeah, so we just got done with practice. It's Friday, so we do all trampolines. So it was two straight hours of trampoline. Uh, Lawrence, why don't you tell us um, sort of what you worked on today? Uh, well, we started with a bunch of drills, warming up with ball outs, brandy ball outs, or randy ball outs, up to those for the higher level athletes. And then we went into some drills on our feet mainly, like brandy straight, stretch jump, or back tuck, stretch jump, and then... Cut! <laughs> Don't make noise. Can you go video? <laughs> <laughs> And then uh, I went into sets of 10 doubles. I started with half out pike, double pike. Then I moved on to some Rudy out tucks, or Rudy out pike, double tucks. Were you kind of nervous about the Rudy out pike, double tuck? That's the first time you've done it, right? Um, that's the first time I've done that, but I have done Rudy out pike, half half tuck before, so oh, okay. I wasn't nervous for that one. Okay. But then coach had me doing Randy out tuck, double tuck, and I was really nervous for that one because mm -hmm. I haven't been doing... I'm going to out as much as I should be because I've been stressing optionals. So, went through those a bit. I only got through a set of three and I did a back tuck instead of a double tuck. Okay. I it, saw the video of the Randy out back tuck, Randy out to Matt, and um, I'll play that uh, over the back. Yeah. And um, after that, I moved on to optionals and did approximately eight, if you don't count the mates. <laughs> <laughs> And then at the end, I just worked on trip tuck, half half trip tuck for a while. Nice. And you did your optional with two trips today. Yeah, for the first time. Nice. That was dope. I like that. Thank you. Um, so, uh, <laughs> what did you work on today? Um, I did the same thing I always do. I did a whole bunch of uh, brainies, like brain tuck, back tuck, and um, brain pipe, back pike, and brain straight, back straight. Just trying to work on my arms up, and that's what mm -hmm. I've been working on, recovering from back injury. So haven't been bouncing too high. Gotcha. And you just had an MRI today. I did. So that's exciting. Yeah, that was fun. The doctor finally got through to the sports therapist who finally got through to the yeah. MRI people. I hate the healthcare system. <laughs> Same. <laughs> Same. Uh, okay, Dan? Um, I did a few drills and then I did some cruising skills from that and some 10 bounces. Nice. And a couple of routines. What kind of times did you do on the 10 bounces? Um, around 19.10. Okay. And I saw you doing that one thing where you put the um, the piece of foam between your ankles. Oh, that's to uh, try to keep it in our legs so we keep our legs together. Nice. That looked fun too. Okay, and then um, why don't you talk about what kind of goals you have for the rest of the season? Um, or for the coming up part of the season? Uh, probably get a higher DD in my routine. Okay. Win a couple of weeks. Nice. Hopefully you win your first meet because you haven't competed yet, right? No. Okay, I'm excited for when that comes up. Um, so basically, we have uh, you know just over a month off um, to train for the next meet we're going to is Randy's meet in Ohio at Gymnastics Central, right? Um, so this is a cool meet because it's going to be the first meet we've ever been to besides the team trials or nationals where we actually compete in the elite division. Um, <clears throat> so. Basically, what I want to do at that meet is I want to I want to throw down on double mini at least because I've never I've tried like three times at nationals in a row to compete my full full straight, but I never get it on double mini because I, I never get my hips through and I end up tucking it and then I have to change up my, the rest of my passes um, to account for that. So I really want to do that and I want to do a full full tuck and maybe the Brandy full mount. That'd be dope. Yeah, and we're trying to beat Randy because he's yeah. probably going to attempt to throw a triff at this meet. On yeah, the and, and or a triple back. And or a I, triple back. I saw he just did that. That was exciting. And, uh, yeah, I want to beat Randy at his home meet. That'd be fine. <laughs> 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 on Tramp, I actually would like to get my routine through completely. At the first meet, I fell off. And at the meet 
two weeks, last week? Yeah, our, last week our home meet. At our home meet. I made it through 10 skills, but ended up dropping two of them. So I haven't actually made my optional yet at a, at a competition. And so I'm working some new stuff in it, but I'm not going to put those in mm. until I make it for, through a couple of uh, competitions with Fire Team credits. Nice. And it's, you know, you've fallen at two meets so far, but it's really not the biggest deal because we're working to peak at nationals. We're still in the beginning of the season where you haven't done that many routines, right? So I don't think it's too big of a deal. And as long as, I mean, are you, yeah, we just need to build some more confidence. So what are you, what are you trying to do at Randy's meet? Um, for Randy's meet, I'll for sure be doing an 8-8 eight, eight or higher. Okay. Probably around a 9-4, okay. depending on how I'm feeling. And I'd really like to push my form this year. Yeah. Um, and I want to get my highest aesthetic score as I've ever gotten. Nice. Well, at that at that last meet, we just finished the home meet. Um, your form was on point. Your form is fantastic. Did you see it? No, I didn't. See Whatever. It. I'll I'll try to find a video. But um, your form was good. The only thing you were missing was height. Yeah. I thought. And some difficulty. And some yeah, but it was your compulsory. Okay. So the compulsory just looks beautiful, and we just need to push the height up. Anybody have anything else they want to say, Dan? Lawrence? Also at Randy's meet, since it is elite, we will be competing our compulsory and our option. That's right. And it will be the first time, hopefully, that I compete my compulsory with four skills. N not necessarily four skills for difficulty because USTA still has no That's right. difficulty skills. But instead of doing my compulsory that begins with three quarterback Cody, I started with two large skills, trip tug, half half tug, and end with two. Higher difficulty skills, really up like Miller, tuck or straight. I need to work for this straight. Oh, I still want you to throw a Miller on double mini too. I still never seen that. That's been a challenge. Of, <laughs> yeah, I can't um, for a while around straight. So whatever. We got yeah, all stuff to be easier though, anyways. So. Joe, signing out. Uh -huh. All right. Uh, see ya. <laughs> 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 Thank you.